I'm on my way to FedEx. Fit in. Entire package is accomplished. Got the bad boys installed. Got them laying it down. There they are. That's, you know, because I'm not going to install them today. It's a little too late. Stay tuned. You can see it's it's cold down here in Texas. I'm here on the Tuluka channel. Give me a night live update. You know, I had my uh my wheels and tire package delivered. I went and picked it up. I'ma just upload that. But then because of this winter storm, I can't get my uh my wheels and tires put on my, my vehicle right now. I was gonna do it, but it's too cold for me, so I was gonna pay somebody to do it. So when it warm up, you'll get that that nice update. But uh, yeah, I'm over here. I was at at the JLB doing a little something. But as you can see, it's a winter storm down here. I got my uh, Black Knight chilling right here. In effect, we're about to roll out, get on the road, trying to stay safe. Just want you guys to know. I ain't forgot about you. Woo -wee. Yeah, I'm representing the Cowboys. Yeah, I know they haven't been doing too good the last couple of years, but hey, I'm a diehard fan. <laughs> Not no bandwagon. Whenever we do go up, you gonna know. Two look have been down with them for the with the cars. Oh, from sport down to snow and ice, cause that's what it's doing today. And we off. It's so clean. And that snow, boy, look at that thing, boy. Look at that thing. Wait till I get them wheels and tires on at it this week. I can't wait, y'all. Then we're gonna do that video on the calipers too. Yeah. How's the latest video changing the, uh, the emblem to just black and red instead of chrome now and stuff so <sighs> baby it's cold outside cleared up on the road a little bit trying to avoid any black ice if i can so i'm gonna go the back way to my my home in time since we had a winter storm like this down here in the dfw area where the trains are you can see it's fully packed Snow and ice. So, yeah. It is pretty though. Seeing all this winter wonderland, all this snow and uh, ice, but a lot of people down here in Texas don't know how to drive in it. I got some experience because I spent some time in Washington State, Spokane, Washington, and in Germany and Italy and other places around the world that had a bunch of snow. So I've had the pleasure and opportunity to drive in it. So I'm a little bit more aware and cautious about it. But if you're interested in a truck, the Silverado, the 2020, 2021, and 2022 Silverado Trail Box is trucking along in the snow. And this is where I would normally exit to make a turn onto the uh, interstate, but we're not gonna do that today. We're gonna go straight and go the back way to my crib. Yeah, I say crib. I'm going to go these back ways and try to mosey on home. Look at that snow. So yeah, it's, it's kind of chilly out here. Okay, this is the view 
I have it's somebody in front of me with a, a GMC 8T4. It's pretty clean. They got paper tags on it. Brand new. I thought that was interesting. You know, I'm going the back way. That's why you see all these uh, uh, warehouses and facilities and train tracks. I'm trying to get to my neighborhood. But uh, we trucking along. Pun intended. Uh, we almost there for like five minutes away from my, my subdivision. You know, get through. That's uh, Interstate 820 coming up. You know, but we making it. You know, I had to do a run. Have to go uh, work at the regular job. But uh, it's nobody throwing any salt or sand out on these roads, man. That's what's tripping me out in Texas, man. So you're on your own, so to speak. So we're just gonna keep it moving, you know, cause the uh, whole world out here. I wanted to say that for a while. Made it to the crib safely. Thank God for that. Been an eventful day out here in Winter Wonderland. ice on the windshield. But yeah, in case you forgot, these are the wheels. That's what I got. I can't wait to put them bad boys on it. I wish I could have got them on there. It would have been great to ride on them in this weather. They're hybrids, all-terrain uh, tires. Would have got some good traction on these Federal Explorer RT. It looks extremely well with it, but look at it. I can't believe it. It's coming down hard like this. Haven't seen this in a while, in ages. I think in at least eight years down here in Texas, it ain't been like this, man. So it's a trip. But what y'all think about this? Let me strike this idea to you. I'm thinking about uh, deleting this chrome right here and making it red. And now I don't say black, cause that's not gonna happen. It's gonna either stay chrome or it's gonna be red. So keep it chrome, let me know in the comments down below. Keep it chrome or make it red to match those tow hooks and the, the new emblem on the side. And by the way, the, the lettering in the back, I'm getting ready to change that to match, you know, the accents of red. I'm gonna take that chrome off and then make that red. I got some red, uh, it'll say Chevrolet in red. So we're going with the black and red chrome uh, accent. So, yeah. yeah. We're going with that black and red theme in Winter Wonderland. So let me know in the comments down below. All right. All right, what's up everybody? It's your man Tulika. I'm out here in the winter snow mix down here in Texas. I'm dropping off my uh, Silverado to get the new shoes added on the wheels and tires and I decided not to do it myself I'm gonna let Firestone do it because uh, it's cold out here it's like negative one degrees that's cold so I let the professionals do it I told you I'd take you along the journey with me so this is how it looks now see the winter tires I got, got them in the back. So, taking it to Firestone. And, they get a decent price, so. And we'll keep you posted. And we'll see how it looks afterwards, you know. So, and then I'll take it home. It's too cold out here. All right, what's going on now, guys? Real update. The technicians over at Firestone are kind of worried. They don't know if the wheels and tires will fit, but I had them custom made, off custom offset off YouTube to fit my particular uh, Chevy Silverado, so it shouldn't be no problem. They said I could go in there when they get it on and check them out. 
Okay, cool. The mechanic just told me he checked the tires. They got the sensors. So I don't have to worry about the extra cost on that. So they're going ahead and starting with the, uh, with the uh, installation. <laughs> Finally got them on. That's how they look now. So, look around. Got a little poke. Still got to take this out. <clears throat> He's chunky tight. <clears throat> Look though. I'm happy about it. Discount tide did their thing. Y'all let me know in the comments down below what y'all think. Y'all like the setup. Long time coming. We got to go get some gas. Let's go. I know you're curious. I know you're curious about how it handles and how it drives. It <clears throat> feels great. It feels just like it did. It just feel like there's more traction, uh, especially in this winter mix we got down here in DFW on the snow and ice. I'm picking up a little bit more traction. I got it on snow mode, uh, so to speak. So yeah, now I'm going back to the Ponderosa, back to the house. Uh, no, I got to go to Home Depot, but I got to get some uh, fuel first because I'm on low. I've been uh, just driving and driving, not paying attention to my my uh gas <laughs> anybody done that before let me know in the com comments down below uh but yeah we got the new shoes on finally on on the dark night black night you know we're still working on a name for the truck but uh we all we uh on to the next big thing you know i'm going to uh change out my uh my lettering on my tailgate this modification video vlog remix to you. Stay tuned. Two. All right, this is the wheels on the vehicle. This is the stands. Can you see it? Can you see it? It's mean, boy. Got a little poke just a little bit but i get full turn on it and these are 33s i got uh 33s on here get inflated good 33s on here still got much space when i turn not hitting nothing didn't have to didn't have to cut. Didn't have to cut nothing. So. All right, 
right, y'all. It's the ride in the snow. It's dirty, but that's the new wheels on there. Tell me what y'all think. Let me know if you like the new setup. See you next time. Same back channel. You hit the notification bell anytime, every time I upload.